Fighting Fear, a movie about two mates going through the adversities in life. Mark Matthews and Richie Vass were down and out, mate. They were getting on the piss, fighting people, just being bad, as they do. But coming back and coming on strong, surfing the biggest waves and fighting in, you know, in the octagon, mate. It's amazing. It's a good story. We got them coming out of the Today Show, straight onto the Hoy Show, so check it out. It's a good interview. And Macker as a filmmaker, he's just gone above and beyond to, to even his ex expectations, I think. Like, everyone knew he was, he was seriously talented when he started studying film. Like, it was after he had he had been, you know, like looking to be a professional soccer player, had, you know, a promising career, had a bad accident on the drink, so he knew the themes of the movie. Lost his soccer career and went into went into film, which is sort of a blessing in disguise. He could he could study his arts, film and, and music. So, I mean, a positive message coming off the back of Fighting Fear was the most important thing when we were making the movie because I watched, you know, like the majority of kids who grew up below us either end up in jail or on hard drugs and you know ruin their lives or put them in a spot where it's going to be hard to come back from. So, we really wanted something to show kids to learn from the mistakes we made and. You know, hopefully they get on a, on a more positive path early, and it leads them into you know even better lives than, than what we're living. Growing up as a kid, you know, you're, you're scared of being accepted. You know, you always want to you know, impress your peers and be, and fit in. The film is you know trying to encourage right. you to you keep know. your eyes on on what you want to achieve out of life and chase your dreams. And it was just a story of, of how we and off the rails and and try to show kids that you know, the mistakes we made, and hopefully they don't have to go through it themselves. It's just been picked up by the Board of Education to be used as a, as a teaching device, you know. They're finding it so hard to teach kids in schools about binge drinking and the troubles of street violence, you know. Kids don't want to hear it from teachers who, who are 40 years old, got kids, and they, you know, they don't... They want to hear it from someone who's younger, does what they... has done what they're, they're going through and is still going through it. Both Richie and I are, are like... You know, we're still going through all the issues that they're facing with binge drinking and stuff like that. We still party, we still have to, you know figure out how to make the right decision. So, I mean, they can just relate to it a lot better coming from us too, I think. It's good to hear the boys' experience. Pretty inspiring stuff. Here's the trailer. Mac has done a great job. Check it out. When you have a belief that you can do something, that's really all you need. Richie Vance. Richie? This crazy little brute. Mark Matthews has ridden the wave of his life. You know, everything I see from him is just charging something big and mutant. Mark and I have been mates for as long as I can remember. <laughs> we surfed as hard as we could, and we also partied harder. And the difference between me and Rich is I kept my clothes on. Like, I was not the only one getting nude. There were plenty of occasions where you were the only one getting nude. We wanted to out drink, out party, and out fight our mates. Not a lot of people even thought we'd make it to 25. Handcuffed and escorted by police, bra boy Richard Vasulik. Oh my gosh, what have you done? The thought of losing him to go to jail. This got absolutely smashed. And there was every chance that Mark wasn't going to be able to surf again. Pretty much the lowest point I've ever been at. Life is about second chances. You can either stay down or get back up to your feet. Movie's amazing, Mac has done a great job. Get to the movies now and check it out.